Hello, Possum Stromer Smith here in Alphacraft at my terribly, terribly high-tech squid farm. It's very simple really, it's just this little stretch of river near my base and when there's no one on the server and I've got some time, which I do at the moment, I just go up and down killing the squid and the salmon that appear. At the moment it's running really, really slowly. I'm getting one or two a pass, sometimes I can get four or five. I just need to restock my ink sacs, that's all. So I just come up one end, see what spawns, and head back down to the other end and kill anything in the meantime. Okay, two more ink sacs and I'll have a stack and that'll be it for the day. I'll pop those away and I'll meet you at the inferno. Here we are and Susie Naveau had the best word for this tacky. <laughs> That's what I was going for. I still have to fix up lighting out here. <laughs> but I wanted to show you I've added a couple more items to Amy's list of things that she sells. So someone's bought all the blaze heads already and magma blocks. Wow. So yeah, we've got blaze rods, we've got blaze heads, and we've got magnum blocks. No, they're there. Why is that coming up as out of stock? That's weird. Why aren't you selling them, Amy? Does she not like them? Oh, if it's not one mystery, it's another. They're definitely in there. Uh, I'll have to ask someone. I'll have to get it sorted out. <sighs> yeah, okay. There are things I want to do down here. I want to start working on the walls around that thing. And I want to get this so that it's a bit safer for people coming, well, for me basically coming in. I'm sick of getting blasted by ghasts. First thing I need to do is extend this wall to here. And then I want to get the sides done. Yeah, all right, so first things first. And I might switch to replay for this. It might be a little bit more interesting for you. Um, and when it comes to marking that out, we'll go back into first person. Okay. So that's what I've achieved so far. Um, I am actually going to do a bit more work on this. I want some arches underneath. I want glass there so I can come and go without worrying about gas out here. Although once we get the floor in there shouldn't be too many gas to worry about but they still sort of drift in from the lava ocean there and I'm sure there are some spawning there. I don't know. Or possibly there. That should be slabbed. I'll have to work out how to get down there. Oh, not doing that at the moment. I've died in the nether far too many times. So next, supports for this. That's our centre. 
and that's an even number so I've got to remember that so that's our edge here and we're going to go out five from here so uh, one two three four five brings us up with this well that's sort of cool that can join in and I'm actually going to make this here level it's going to be a big plaza and we're going to have some statuary in the plaza as well oh I've got plans somebody said on my comments it was gothic which is true but it's also a bit Byzantine as well so now we need 11 between this and the next one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So that. Okay, I'm going to go round marking bays of 11 and we'll see where it gets us. Actually, I'm changing how I do it. That's an 11 and this is 9. 11s and 9s? And I'm popping a torch on the ones that I'm using. And let's get rid of the ones that we're not. Oh, here we go. I got it all marked out. And then I worked out what to do with this middle section. And now I've changed my mind about all those markings. <laughs> I'm going to have to work it out. And this is too low. Oh my goodness, this is too low. That should be the cloister level, the Wither Skeleton Farm should be up the top of that, but that would have put it out of the reach of the bounding box of the fortress, so we wouldn't have got any Wither Skeletons in it. So while this is all going to stay like this, well, I'm going to put a plaza here, but that's beside the point. In there, I may yet dig it out another five or six blocks. Oh, and I've just noticed <laughs> there's a stair missing there. I'll have to fix that. But what I'm going to do next is do on this side what I've been doing here, which is two rows of stairs. So I'll go up into the farm and I'll show you how I access that. And then we'll start thinking about under here. So I've got to go the long way around. Oh, no, I don't. I'm silly. I can't even get out the door. I made a quick access up to the farm and I have been going backwards and forwards all the way around through the nether tunnels. Ah, oh. I mean, what do I think this is for? <laughs> that was a big jump. Here's me going the long way around all the time. <sighs> oh, there's lots of them. We'll come back for them. Right, first things first, let's get that. All right, first things first, let's get that missing block on. Oh, please, may there not be any ghasts. There it is, hooray. I'll pick them up later or not, I'm not worried. Now, silk touch pickaxe. And I come out here and I do that. And now I do that. And I do this all the way along. right the way to the end then I come back uh, <laughs> and I have a little fit I get rid of those and I put it one block down and repeat the same thing I've just got that there so I don't fall in and we might uh, take out that and put that in yep 
and now we just repeat the same thing uh, on this level and yet this this is a bit nerve-wracking <laughs> but um, I'll do that all the way to the end and I'll worry about the other side when I have the full design finalized on this side That's not a bad start. I still don't know what to do with this, but it's going to be a grand entrance onto what's essentially going to be a piazza of some sort. And I think this is how I'll fill in the walls. I mean, you saw it when I was making it, and I do think it looks better with the andesite on the outside uh, swapped out for cobble, especially on the inside. Now, there's going to be more going on here, but we will worry about the inside when we get the outside done. And of course, wouldn't you know it, every time I turned the camera off, I got attacked by three or four or more ghasts. And every time I turned it on, they all went away. It's like a charm. There's one more thing I'm thinking of doing, which is maybe adding... Ah! Flying buttresses. I don't want to... Oh. Well, do you know, I was always wondering how I'd get these two blocks. This was not how... I envisaged doing it. I'm definitely going to fill this in. Oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, not too much. Okay. Oh, well, we got them. <laughs> uh, back up, back up, back up. All right, pay attention to where you're walking. Now, stand still, no wandering around. I'm wondering about flying buttresses, but if we can just... No, I don't want to fall off that. I don't think I'll put one there because it ends up being too close to the blaze farm. Um, whether I end up filling this wall gap and just joining the two, I don't know yet. It's one of those things of I'll just have to build it and see what happens. And yeah, this is a bit haphazard because I always knew there was going to be a wither skeleton farm there. KB and I discussed it um, right back when we we're working on the blaze farm but uh, that got built and this got put off but oh, that has taken hours and hours and hours so I think that's going to be enough of building in the nether today but I'm going to take the mound of gas tears that I got here and I'm going to go put them away before anything happens to them so I will meet you back at base and I thought I may as well do some brewing while I'm here.
Hello. 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 Um, hello. Hello. Can I help you? Hello, madam. You? Um, well, actually, I was wondering if I could help you, madam. Um, I was wondering if you had seen these before. Uh, it looks very familiar. Yes. It wouldn't You've happen to be a shock seen... box. It would, indeed, but this is the latest model. Uh, recently sourced um, in fully organic ways from the end dimension. Um, but just check out that animation. I mean, mm. smooth, smooth. Yeah. These ones come in all of the colour varieties that you can that you can have. Nice content. And, yeah, uh, I'll, I'll just remove some of the contents there. Um, uh, but, yes, we are setting up a new endeavour in the area, and mm -hmm. we are selling end-related products so we have shulker boxes and we have elytra and mm. we are wondering i was wondering if i could interest you in some of these fine products um when you say we <laughs> are you only operating door to door um at do present you have a we're shop currently front? we're currently operating door to door madam but we are looking to set up a retail concession in the very near future okay that's encouraging Yes. So what sort of prices are you talking about? Because, yeah, I can go to the end and get these myself, but it, it is a little bit of a pain, but it's doable. Yes. So what sort of prices yes. are you suggesting for this? Well, I'm, as I said before, these are completely ethically sourced. Um, mm. They're, uh, uh, unfortunately, some shulkers uh, were, 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 were brutally murdered in the sourcing of these. However, however, madam, don't let that, that put you off. These are the finest quality of shulker shells. Uh, because of that danger that you have to face in the end and the distance that you have to travel, these are a premium product. So we offer these shulkers for five diamonds each. Are they thoroughly but cleaned? Th they are cleaned and they are fully colorable. So we can offer a coloration service free of charge. Or if you should wish, you can choose your own coloration for these mm -hmm. these shelters. Mm -hmm. But they're fully disinfected. They're fully checked and tested in the um, in the end dimension before we bring them back. Okay. Do you have and any in terms special deals like bulk orders or? We do, madam. We do. We we offer uh, three of these fine shelters. So these would individually be five diamonds each. However, mm -hmm. three of these shulkers we can offer you for the steel of 12 diamonds. Okay. What if I made you a counter offer? Are you open to a bit of barter? We, we are quite happy to barter, madam. What would you say to some of these? Um, are those gas tears, madam? Those are gas tears. Mm, that's very interesting, madam, because at uh, Eth Ethically Sourced Chelker Incorporated, we are always looking to expand our um, entrances to the end dimension uh, and the end portals. So mm -hmm. I'm sure that we could come to some kind of an arrangement. How many of those fine things do you, do you ha have? Uh, I have a few. How many would you want for a shulker? Well, um, there... I would say that four of those would we would allow us to exchange for one of the shulkers. Mm -hmm. But of course, you can do a combination of the gas tears and diamonds if you sh if you should wish. Um, well, it's because we we do we ha um, unfortunately, although those are useful for us, we do have staff costs that yeah, we need yeah, to take yeah. into get, account, and they that. will only accept diamonds. So I get it's, that. It, yeah. So it's five each or three for 12? Absolutely. And you want four for a shulker? Yes. What if now, I gave if you I, we could... ten, for, 10 for three shulkers? Let me just... Uh... Yes, deal. I, uh, I think that we can do that deal, madam. I'll tell you what, because you've come all the way out here and you have 
what amounts to a possibly honest face. Although Very the dolly, honest, madam. the dolly's a bit disconcerting. And we um, we've also done the favour of making sure that you don't have any of the unscrupulous salesmen um, in in your your area as well. <laughs> yeah, he was hanging around earlier. Yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, we've had dealings with with these gentlemen in the past, and the deals that they offer are nothing, nothing like ethical Shogger Incorporated. Oh. So. All right. Well, I've put some gas tears in there. <gasps> Fantastic, madam. And that I have, is that is I wonderful. I have thrown in the extra two. Now, because that you enables like... you to do f three expansions. Yes, it does, madam. And uh, so, and we we're, uh, we're very grateful. At and a what later we can... date. Oh, sorry, go on. Yeah. Go no, on. go on. Go on, madam. No, 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 no. Tell me no, what the you're going to say. The customer's always right, no, no. madam. I will, I will. Tell me what you're going to say. Can I have my three shocker boxes? You can. Would you like us to colour these for you, madam? No, it's, it's, it's fine. I'll work out what colour I want them okay. as, I, as I need. Okay, madam. If you don't mind, I'll just put my mobile construction set up here. Well, and then okay, I can but create you could actually have used that one. Ah, well, we, we, we like to, to know the quality of the construction, um, and that means that we do bring our own our, our own things. So if Fair I enough. will just... Three of the finest shock boxes. Much. I will, of course, stay here whilst you do, um, whilst you do test that you are happy with, uh, with the opening and closing of those shockers. Well, the other thing is, how does it stick? Oh, that's not bad. Yeah. yeah the stick sticks on any surface, madam. important. Madam. Oh, and from Even the ceiling. Even sticks on the ceiling. Nice. Yes. Yeah, that seems to be in fine order. Well, thank you for your patronage. Um, please do bear us in mind for any of your shocker uh, or end-related needs, in fact. If you need any purple blocks, any end stone, again, we can also do further deals with you. Um, any elytra, of course, then please do let us know. And also mm -hmm. let us know if you are having any trouble with uh, these gentlemen and we can uh, send send some people around to sort out your problem. Ah, so you have a pest extermination service as well. We Good do, we do. We Good offer that um, in, in a variety of near and far locations. Mm -hmm. okay. This little flat seems to become my de facto home more so than the shed. It seems to be the one that I run to when I need somewhere to sleep. It's the one above the fish shop, the fishmongers. And that was interesting, the travelling salesman. I can't help feeling that we've been done though, like a dog's dinner. Every set of four tiers I gives him is access to a whole lot more shulker boxes and I'm wondering if I should have pushed for it to be more than a shulker box worth. I should have stuck to the idea of ten for three. Ah, oh, I'm such a soft touch. Ah, <sighs> we'll get it sorted out. I am going to head back into the nether but I am not going now. I've got other things I need to do and if you're looking for other things to do there are end cards on the screen linking to some more videos of mine and also go check out all the other alphas. They're a whole lot of fun. I'm going to keep building, I'm going to keep working and I will see you next time. Bye!